everyone, it's Sammy and welcome to the Freckled Fawn channel. Today we are kicking off a new series on the blog called Washi Wednesday. So I hope to have a coordinating video for you guys sharing a tutorial or a cute way to use washi tape. And we'd really like to feature your projects over on the blog. So if you would like to submit your Washi Wednesday projects, I have a Google Forms um, link in the description box down below. You can enter your projects, just one, entry per Google form. So submit it and then fill it out again for the next project. So that way I can easily keep track of individual projects. On the form, it does ask for a link to your project via a blog or an online gallery. If you don't have a blog and you don't know what I'm talking about um, when I'm saying online gallery, just let me know in the comment section below. I'd be happy to do a screen tutorial for you guys and walk you through how to set up an online gallery so you can submit projects. We are also gonna be having a Friday feature as well. So I'll talk more about that on Friday when I start sneak peeks for you guys. Um, but for this video, for the purpose of this video, I wanna talk all about washi tape and we're starting with the very basics today. It's how to cut your washi tape. Washi tape is great because it's super easy to work with. You can just rip it, of course. You can cut it with scissors. I use these cutter bee scissors quite a bit for cutting washi tape. But if you are attaching it in a specific place and you need it cut at a specific spot, I have a couple of quick tips for you guys. Um, one is grab yourself a cheapy ruler. I'm sure I picked this one up for really cheap. You can just cut the washi tape directly with um, your ruler. So I do this all the time for my planner. You can see I added a little piece of washi tape there. I used the ruler to cut it at both corners and then I used the ruler to cut some of these other pieces over here too. I do use scissors when it's on the edge. I can cut easily just along the edge with scissors. So I just want to show you guys this quick technique. You can use a ruler or you can use a credit card. In my case I have a gift card here. You just roll out the washi tape that you want to use and line it up wherever you want it. Of course, for this, I just need to put it down on my paper. And then you're gonna hold your um, straight edge. It can be the ruler or your card, and then just pull your washi tape and it leaves you with a beautiful straight edge. Now this works for most washi tapes. It is sometimes a little bit tricky with those glitter washi tapes. It doesn't quite rip as cleanly as it does with some of these regular washi tapes. I've found that it works really nicely even with the foiled washi tapes. It's just the glitter washi tape. Same thing with the ruler. Just put it down wherever you want it. Hold your ruler flush and pull. It's just super duper easy. I've been using this technique for a long time now. I just absolutely love it. Something that makes applying washi tape so much easier, especially in something like a planner when you want it to be, you know, perfectly cut where you want it. That is it for today. Be sure to submit your washi tape projects using the link in the description box down below. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Be sure to give this video a thumbs up if you're a washi fan and be sure to subscribe. We plan on putting out a couple new videos every week for you guys. I hope you're having a great day and I'll catch you guys next time. Thanks for watching.